Today we live in a culture obsessed with security. It's a world of fear where people actually prep for attack, whether it's from zombies or something else. We become preppers who pack away food, make plans for escape and pack a bag just in case. Our kids have lockdown practice as often as they have fire drills and bulletproof blankets are now manufactured for unimaginable scenarios. A seminary president tells his students to pack heat so they can blow the stranger away when the need arises. We pray that whatever the boogeyman is, whoever the monster is under the bed or in the closet, he won't come to us today. We ask God to keep us in the comfort of our homes, wrapped in a security blanket of amusement, consumerism, because we know that's how he wants us to live. What? Have we actually read the Bible? What is our mission to culture? To love our enemies, to love the world. We've got to get off our high knees, off the sofa, off the back deck, off the computer, off the smartphone, and involved in people's lives. We become so imprisoned in our own fearful retreat that we've given up what it means to be human and even partly Christian. When we do that, we've given up the mission to culture entirely. Join us for the final evening Simpson lecture where I tackle the myth of security. What did Jesus say? Come to me and I'll give you everything you ever wanted? Not in your life. He said, come to me and I will give you rest for your soul. That's our security. And we, when we have that security, we can embrace the risk that is ours in Christ. If the world hated me, he said, it's gonna hate you. Take up your cross daily, die to self, and follow me. That kind of discipleship is what we're called to in our culture today. Do we have what it takes to leave Babylon, to not be Babylon anymore, and to reclaim our mission to culture? Come and find out.